Microscopes are of two categories, light microscope, and electron microscope. The light microscope includes bright field microscope, dark field microscope, fluorescence microscope and phase contrast microscope. In the light microscopy, the magnification is obtained by a set of optical lenses using light waves. The electron microscope uses a beam of electrons to produce the image. The bright field microscopy is the most widely used microscope by students and other professionals. It is important to understand the working principle of compound microscope. In this microscope, the field is brightly lighted, by using an external light source, and the microorganisms appear dark, as they absorb some of the light. Usually, microbes do not absorb much light, but staining them with a dye, greatly increases their light absorbing ability. Now, let us understand the working principle, and construction of a compound microscope. Compound microscope has two convex lenses. The lens which is placed close to the object, is called objective lens. The lens which is closer to the eye, is called eyepiece, or eye lens. Both these lenses are attached to a body tube. The body consists of an arm, connected to a strong base. The coarse, and fine adjustment knobs allow the two lenses slide in the body tube, in order to bring the object in focus. Below the objective lens, there is platform, also called a stage, and it has got two clips to hold the glass slide. A small aperture present just below the stage, allows the light from the light source to the objective lens. Just above the light source, there is an iris, also called as diaphragm, which controls the amount of light passing into the aperture present on the stage. The objective lens has a shorter focal length, than the focal length of eyepiece. In this diagram, an object AB is placed in front of the objective lens, just beyond its focus point FO. The light rays pass from the subject AB, through the objective lens, and form a virtual image A1B1, in between the focus point of the eye lens FE, and the eye lens. Now, this magnified and inverted virtual image, becomes an object for eye lens. The focus of the object A1B1 is adjusted by the eyepiece. Then, the eyepiece forms a magnified virtual image A2B2 of the object, at the least distance of distinct vision, which is 25 centimeters for a normal human eye. Now, how to calculate the magnification. Most microscopes have three, or four different objective lenses, with different ranges of magnifications, usually 10x, 40x and 100x. If the object is focused under a 100x object lens, the total magnification will be obtained by multiplying this value, by the magnification value of the eyepiece, which is usually 10x. This gives a magnification of 1000x of the object. Hope you have understood the principle of compound microscope. If you have any questions, please comment in the comments section below. If you like the video, please hit the like button or comment and share. Please do subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get notified on the upcoming videos.